Rise up! Right for Dark Rebellion Xyz Dragon! Two hundred dollar cutscene. Yuto is here with the new box, and I do believe he is top tier in my hands. Let's go. The Phantom Break. Zeus, do Zeus, do Zeus. Yeah, buddy. Should I pop the MST or itself? Then I do a uh, rank four, right? Detach. Pop it. Oh, shoot. I don't have another Phantom Ray in the grave. No! I messed up. There can only be one winner, and you're looking at it. Let's go. Seriously though, this feels like top tier potential. I did have some brick hands. I was able to get a five and O oh win streak though. The deck is so simple. It's all about if you have a Phantom Knight in your hand, you discard it with the skill to send a fog blade to the bottom of your deck, which is a Fiendish Chain. That's all you need to know, it's a Fiendish Chain, but you could search it. So with Fiendish Chain now in your deck, if you have Boots in the Graveyard, you banish it to search for Fiendish Chain. Amazing. Now to search Boots, you need Cloak to banish from the Graveyard, which you could discard the skill, to grab Boots. And what if you don't have Cloak and you don't have Boots? You then have Ragged Gloves. Ragged Gloves could send Cloak, Cloak can search Boots. Amazing. Those are the banish effects in the Grave. Now, Boots has the special effect of if you have a Phantom Knight in the field, special summon. And the Cage Mucha has the special effect of when you normal summon a monster, you special summon Cage Mucha. So you have six monsters that could perform a special summon onto the field. The deck's all about rank threes. You will rank three into your main monster, Phantom Knight the Break Sword. This is like a Scrap Dragon. You could pop your own card and then another card in the field. And if you want, you could pop itself. If you pop itself, it activates summoning both Phantom Knights in the graveyard as level four, which you could then make a Malevolent Sin. If it's not the same turn, you activate the skill. Or you could make a Dark Rebellion Exceed Dragon. Really good for lethals. Reduce your opponent's attack by half and then gain the attack. Essentially a direct 2500 attack. Very nice. You could cheese with a Nightmare Shark. Turn one, you could do Dante to mill your cards. Be careful about milling your Fog Blade, even though it's at the bottom of the deck. If you shuffle your deck at all with the effect of the Cloak or the Ragged, then you're gonna, your Fog Blade might, may go on the top of your deck and you might mill it. So be careful with Dante milling. If you shuffle, maybe just Dante mill one, because generally we're just trying to detach the material. And that's very simple about the deck. You could use whatever you want for the other cards. They do not matter. The Fog Blade and the Phantom Knight Sword in the graveyard, they could banish to summon a Phantom Knight from the grave. The deck's a lot of fun. Always think about Levy Air for lethal. Summon the Levy Air with the rank three exceed. Levy Air detach of material, summon the monster you banished or the cloak. And then if you have another monster to make with the monster you Levy Aired, then you got lethal. You have Break Sword, which could then pop itself on another card, opening up the fields for lethal to then make a Malevolent Sin plus the Levy Air attack for game. Break Sword is 3000 attack if you use Ragged Gloves with it. And I love it. It's a lot of fun. I did have a lot of fun playing this. Thank you for supporting this video. I'm quite out of breath. I'm very tired tonight. I, I overstreamed a bit. All right. I love you. I love you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go. Cloak is going to send, banish, grab. Okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. Okay. Great. We got this. So we're gonna grab the boots and then we're great. Yep. We're gonna normal summon the ragged gloves, trigger the cage moocha. The cloak is going to grab a boots. And then we could special summon the boots alongside the ragged gloves if he disrupts us in any way. Then we will be able to grab the fog blade and negate and we're good. 
And now I hit Balfe at the end of the turn, man. You, there's no way to just... You have point, I point 0.5 seconds to click and then move up. It's not going to happen. Steric sign. Add back. We're good. All right. Let's see if the back was activatable by looking at the hourglass. It's not activatable. Not activatable. Send the cloak. Cloak activates. Gonna grab the boots. Get booted. Oh, please. Please. Please work. Please work. Please work. I need this W. I need this W. You're a top tier deck. I need this W. Oh, it actually worked. Actually worked. I'm special summoning this also. We're going to pop it. Yeah, we could detach the ragged gloves and pop. Okay, good, good, good. Three thousand attack. Yes. Yes. Detach ragged. Pop. You set a bluff against me? Against me? You set a bluff? We got Fog Blade. And Ragged Gloves will send another cloak for next turn. Just because it's once per turn, I'm just going to use it now to send a cloak. Perfect. 3,000 attack. I love it. Then Breaksword, I think Breaksword's going to pop itself in the final pop. I'll pop itself, only making sure we have two Phantom Knights in the graveyard, though, to do so, which we don't right now. So, uh, how do I do that? How do I make sure I have two? Swoop in, Harpy Lady. Swooping on in, Harpy Lady. If you want to use your Elegant Egotist, if you have another one, I'm just going to bottomless you. Get bottomless in. Bottomless, bottomless. No chair boonie, mate. Get out of here. It's my Monster reborn. Monster reborn. I'm just getting rid of the fog blade. Let's go. It's time. It is time. I activate ancient cloaks effect. It's cutscene time. Don't screw me, bro. Be cool. Be cool. I need this. I need this. I'm down bad. Okay, we have enough. If we pop itself. Boost it, boost it, boost it. Detach. Pop itself. Pop that. Activate. I'm speed running, speed running. One, two, let's go. One, two, attack, attack. One, two. Come on, come on, come on. One, two, three. Yes. $200 cutscene. Ready for this? Ready for this? Yes. Yes. That is what I'm talking about. My monster attacks you. Wait, no voice line? What? Oh, I wait. No. No dark rebellion exceed dragon dark flame blast. I can't believe my car techniques didn't work. My phantom knights may fall, but they always get back up. That's how I battle too. Smile flame. 
Win streak. Going with the five. Just craft it, Nate. Just craft it. Just craft it. Event ends on the second. Wait, really? On Wednesday? It Wait, does it end at midnight on Tuesday? It technically ends tomorrow, right? I have today and tomorrow to get another copy. Wow. That's not Q. Yeah, that's really bad. That sucks. That sucks. Please, Konami, bring the crafting system to Duel Links. Jtastic, I know. What the heck? Resubbing for Master Duel shenanigans. Thank you very much, Angel. I appreciate that greatly. Delombera, hey DK, so glad to see your channel grow this much in such a short time. Keep up the good work. I appreciate you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Of course, we're overtiming for Duel Links. I love Duel Links. Ragged gloves, raggedy gloves, raggedy gloves. All right, so if we get raggedy gloving, because we loving it, we will normal summon the gloves, special summon the cage moocha. Thank you very much. We got an annoying board here, yeah. Definitely annoying. Send it, banish. Grab the fog blade. All right, so we levy air. Wait, could boots summon if there's a boots on the field? Except boots? Okay, good, good, good. Detach, summon boots. Ragged Gloves, send. Cloak. And we're going to grab the boost of the hand. Get boots in. Special summon. Don't I win if I just do the break sword? What's the damage I have? Malev sin for game? Holy crap. It's that easy. Detach, pop itself, and pop the Sky Iris, right? It doesn't matter what I pop because we'll just... If I pop this, then I could banish and we win. Let's freaking go. I think this deck is top tier. Wait, what? Who said Malevolent Sin? Why can't I Malevolent Sin? Why can't I Malevolent Sin? The skill? You screwed me, chat. He's resummoning if I kill him. Chat told me sin for game. Reduce. 4,000 attack. Holy moly. Let's battle. Attack. Then you come back, right? Yep. Odd eyes. I was supposed to pop it first. You freaking fools. Does this only reduce the attack? So if he would have summoned defense, we wouldn't have lethal anyway. Whoa, look at you. Look at you. Hey, still a win. <laughs> that was a pretty good play, though. Levy Air and Dark Rebellion on, the, on your first turn. It's pretty good. Feels good, feels good. Hey, 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 what are you doing? Stop. No. Okay. Shoot. You got pendulum scales? Oh, bottomless. 
Bottomless, mate. If an Odd Eyes is destroyed battle card effect, you could special summon an Odd Eyes from your hand, deck, or graveyard, so we don't bottomless, actually. Things are about to get more exciting. I if I bottomless, I get screwed, right? Battle. How am I already low? I hate this. I, my I hate this. Banish, summon, search. We could search. We could summon Cage Mucha. We can get the... Uh, okay, we got a rank three. We got the three. Pop the, pop the, and then Malev Sin for game. Okay. We Malev Sinning for game now. Right, it's gonna get me boosted. Get me boosted. I have enough, right? I have enough. Let's go. How am I running out of time? I can't believe this game. Destroy myself. Pop that. Activate. Lev Sin, we win. That's it. He didn't activate. What the heck? We, he knew we would have banished. He knew. He knew. I can't believe the timer's so short. This is crazy. Let's go. Woohoo! Yes! Yes! Finish him! Smash him into pieces! What did I promise you? I promised you a five win streak. Uh, Got it. Let's do Got it. Again. Okay. I don't want Nothing any bull crap comments. Oh, DK doesn't like Duel Links anymore. Cards. We forced no him. Attacks. He wasn't, uh, yeah, he wanted to end early. <laughs> five and oh. We finally, okay, we got something. We got something. Gaia. This is good. Gaia is going to be a good duel to play against. This is a top tier deck, so this will really show us what's good with this deck. All right. We can't activate any card effects in the great during the battle phase. He does have an ability to pop. What the heck was that? That was bad. That was really bad. Okay. Let's activate. So we do want the fog blade in the bottom of our deck. So we're now going to search the fog blade by banishing to send a cloak. Cloak's going to banish to give us the boots. Get booted. And we're going to use Cage Mucha into Cage Mucha. Uh, we're going to use the boots to pop. We're going to pop and then, yeah, I think that's the play we want to do. And we're going to search for the, the fog blade. Let's go. Here I go. I my Activate. Come forth. Should I Dante? I, we're going to be focusing on the, the break sword. Break sword it up. Alrighty. Special summon. Activate. Detach. Pop in the boots, wiping out the Gaia. Gaia, be gone. Boots, banish. Grab the fog blade for a negate. This is a fiendish chain. Fiendish chain. Should I reborn his monster? I don't know if I should reborn for the lulls. Nah. We'll hold it. We'll hold it. Do I need any quick effects? We could fog blade our own monster, so we will be ready for that. Wait, I toggle off. I wasn't looking. Okay. Gaia Origin is discarding a special summon. That's fine. I'm counting on you. I special summon a monster. Should I just bottomless this fool? If he tribute summons, I'll just bottomless the newly summoned. I mean, this is not a threat. 
Tribute summon? What are you doing? What? You're going to end your turn? Dude, what? Boots! Boots with the fur is here. All right. We silent boots. We don't have the way. We don't have enough to do the play. I'm just going to monster reborn your dude and have mercy on you because you look like you're struggling. 2,600 attack. Thank you very much. I will take that. Yoink. Whoa, what? Wait, 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 what? Whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 no. Do not. Activates. Pop the boots, and I guess we get the protection card. What is that? What is the search? The other one gives me a little ba boost. Little ba boost. Get ba boosted. 800 attack and protect from destruction. All right, cool. Oh, wait. He doesn't have 8,000 life. <laughs> Woo! Dual Link's lethal. Let's go. Bool! Back to Master Duel. It's like, thanks. Thanks, I'm out. See ya. Great. Your strategy was so obvious that I thought you were joking.